Hello my three-headed tangerines, it's your boy Zionic Blader, and in this video, I will be ranking every Nilius core released in Bakugan Evolutions from worst to best. I'll be ranking them by their overall competitive viability in the Bakugan Pro TCG. But enough talk, let's get on with the list. Number 5, Ventus Nilius Core. This Bakugan has a poor core lineup of two green fists, which are known for their mid boosts and damage. Ventus Nilius Core has a stat line of 700B power and 2 damage, as well as the effect of removing an opposing Bakugan's core when opening on a Green Fist. Unfortunately, when on the plus 150 Green Fist, Ventus Nilius Core is only at 850B power, meaning if it were to remove a core from a Bakugan, if the Bakugan's base B power is over 850, then Ventus Nilius could still lose. Number 4, Aurelis Nilius Core. This Bakugan has a poor core lineup of two shield cores, which are known for their mid boosts and B power. Aurelis Nilius Core has a stat line of 300 B power and 5 damage, with the effect of removing the opposing Bakugan's core when Aurelis Nilius opens on a shield. Unfortunately, when on the plus 300 shield core, Aurelis Nilius core is only at 600 B power, so even if it were to remove a Bakugan score, it would still lose to the Bakugan that have over 600 B power in base form. With Aurelis Nilius core, you're going to want to focus on damage instead, since when on a high damage boosting helix or fire fist, it can reach the 10 damage minimum for a highest damage wins play. Unfortunately for that, it's going to have to use another Bakugan's core, while only giving shield cores in return, which is not a balanced trade. Number 3, Aquas Nilius Core. This Bakugan has a nice core lineup of Magic Shield and Green Fist. Magic Shield is great because it can give the highest B power boost in the game compared to the other cores. Aquas Nilius has a stat line of 800 B power and 4 damage. Aquas Nilius makes an okay core sharing Bakugan, since it needs a plus 6 Fire Fist to reach the 10 damage minimum while not needing its Magic Shield, which it can give away to a high B power Bakugan that can use it better. Number 2, Chaos Nilius Core. This Bakugan has an amazing core lineup of 2 Magic Shields, which is perfect for high B power focused Bakugan. Chaos Nilius Core is a better version of Aquas Nilius Core. Not only does it have higher damage, allowing it to benefit from both Fire Fist and high damage boosting Helix cores, but also, Chaos Nilius Core has two Magic Shields to spare, making it a great core sharing teammate. And number 1, Darkest Nilius Core. This Bakugan has a core lineup of two Green Fists, however, what makes Darkest Nilius Core great is that it makes a core lineup of two Green Fists amazing. Darkest Nilius Core has a stat line of 600 B power and 3 damage, with the effect of gaining a whopping 1000 B power when on a Green Fist. Meaning, when on the plus 150 B power plus 2 damage Green Fist Core, Darkest Nilius Core is at 1750 B power and 5 damage, which is amazing, adding Darkest Nilius Core with Ventus Pegatrix Core as the new Green Fist Gang, and one of the best B power focused Bakugan in the format. Well, this has been Zionic Blader with my worst to best of Nilius Core from Bakugan Evolutions. What do you think? Do you agree or disagree? Let me know in the comment section below and if you liked the video, hit the like button. Or don't, I'm not the boss of you. But be sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get updated whenever I upload. Until next time, see ya.